Do you want to find out what I chose for my GCSEs? Then keep on watching. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I'm going to show you what I chose for my GCSEs and I'll explain why. I also want to explain why I haven't posted for quite a while. I my mental health hasn't been great. I just realised I'm having an operation. So, yeah, but I will explain it in the Q&A. I don't really know when I want to do the Q&A because the questions are mostly about my mental health. And at the moment, my mental health is good, but not great at the moment. So, I'm just trying to... I'll do that when I feel up for it. So... I'm really excited for this video, so let's get into it. So I'm first going to tell you what you can't really pick from. So you have to do English language and English literature. I don't know if that's the same everywhere, I think it will be, but we have to do that in my school. Then we have to do maths, which is a two exam, I think. Science, which is a two subject exam. I have to do Welsh because I live in Wales. And RE, PA, PE, PSE, and WBQ. I'm not entirely sure what WBQ is though. So, sorry about that. But they're the kind of things that I have to I have to do anyway. Um. Also, guys, you, you may already know this, but I this season. It's all dedicated to GCSE subjects and big exams, so I thought I'd do this video the same as when I did my how to study video because it's like exam, it, it's an exam month kind of thing, so that's why I posted that. Anyway, let's get back into the video. So I had to go on loads of different meetings. I went on five meetings in the course of the week um, in school well wait, not obviously in school it was online on Microsoft Teams and um, I had to go on them with my parents so they knew what we would be doing and I knew what I was going to be doing if I chose those subjects so I'm not going to tell you what I chose yet I'm just going to tell you what meetings I went on so first one I went on is Art and Design and that was really, really good. I really liked looking at that. And I'm not going to give any hints to if I chose it or if I didn't. Just keep on watching. <laughs> Business, food and nutrition, product design and music. And I have to pick three from all of them. So one of our teachers had to put different subjects into three blocks and you have to choose a subject from block A, a subject from block B and a subject from block C um, and I was able to choose the subjects I wanted. So in the first block I had art and design, group work, product design, Spanish, business communications, history and PE GCSE. So out of them I will tell you now what I chose and I'm really happy about this. I chose business because that was one of the subjects that really I really enjoyed looking at that and I feel like I need that business mindset. I also want to create my own business when I'm older um, so I can kind of need obviously the business side of things for that. In the second block I had cope, drama, group work, health and social care, computer science, engineering, history and music. Cope if you're not aware of it is for people with special needs um, that like is mental special needs if that makes sense so in the second block 
I chose music because I just love music. If you've been around, if you're an OG Grace Smiler, then you'll obviously know that I enjoy singing. I used to do Moise Mondays on my old channel, got copyrighted every week, that was great. Then <laughs> I just did singing videos when I felt like it here, like in this channel. So I did really enjoy doing the Moise Mondays. And I'm upset that I can't really sing on YouTube now. I just, I just know that I probably get copyrighted for it. So yeah. <laughs> in the third block, I had art and design, drama, group work, PE, GCSE, digital technology, geography, food technology, and single sciences. And you'll be glad to know that I chose art and design. And the reason why I chose art and design is because I want to start a business with fashion designing. And when I looked at product design, it was more like engineering and like things that I wouldn't be able to do. It was physical stuff and that's something that A, I'm not really interested in and B, I would struggle with a lot of the things that were set and I'd probably get myself really stressed out that I couldn't do it. So I decided to not go with product design and go with art and design instead because that's more of my favourite things as well. So I'm really looking forward to doing the subjects that I chose because I feel like it would be really fun to do them, especially art and design. And also in the subject, you could because obviously there's no guarantee that you'll be able to do the subjects that you've chosen. So you could put in a num number one, two, three of which subjects you really want to do. So for the first one, I put art and design because I'm really looking forward to that. And also guys, there's a weekend away where you can just do loads of art for the entire weekend. I'm hoping that we can actually do that. Hoping Corona doesn't get in the way of it, so <laughs> fingers crossed. Um, and then I put music because music is one of my favourite things, if you know. I'm always on GarageBand on my computer <laughs> writing some new tunes. I actually wrote another song today, so that just kind of shows you that I love singing. <laughs> And then I put business at my three because, like, it's not like a fun subject, if that makes sense. It's really good for having a business mindset, but it's not, like, artistic. So I thought I'd put all of the artistic stuff first and then stuff that is needed but is not artistic third, if that makes sense. So I hope this helps anyone who is deciding on their GCSEs. It didn't take me that long to, to, to find what I wanted to do because I am I was always thinking of what I wanted to do with, with GCSEs anyway. So I kind of just had that in the back, you know. So I'm really happy that I've chosen my GCSEs. I hope this helps anyone who is thinking of their GCSEs. Make sure to go with your gut instincts and do stuff that you will enjoy because if you choose things that, yeah, it's really good for what I want to do when I'm older but you're not really enjoying it, then you're not actually going to learn anything really. So make sure to do really good things and just get creative with all of the subjects that you do. So yes, anyway guys, I will see you in my next video. Bye guys, love you.